Because of the long time between merienda, merienda and cena. cena. You're saying now there's a new meal in between. There's a new, there's always a space to squeeze a new meal. <laughs> Hi everyone, I'm with a friend from Spain and we're here to learn a bit more of the Spanish language as well as more on Spanish culture. Hola. Hola. Eh, ¿Cómo te llamas? Me llamo Noe. Eh, yo soy Mono. Encantada. Encantado. Just to maybe dive right in, mm -hmm. uh, as you can tell, I'm someone who loves comfort. Uh, I do love my own time to sleep and rest. It's a very busy world we mm, live in. It is. Um, could you tell me about how that plays a role in Spanish culture and Spanish life? That plays a huge role mm. <laughs> because we have like a siesta. Siesta. Uh huh. Do you know what it is? Tell me. Tell me about it. Okay. It's like uh, after lunch, around 10 to 15 minutes. The time to pick up the things and put it in the kitchen. You take a nap. Ah, okay. Immediately after lunch? Immediately. Within half an hour, 15 minutes. Most perfect time. And is this uh, a proper nap in bed, in your bedroom? Or no. is this on the desk, on the couch? Couch. Couch. You got it. Okay. It has to be in the couch. Maybe Go. your phone is nearby. You yeah, have to be on standby like a, for a you call. You are watching TV. You are like... But you are sleeping. Yeah. Okay. No limit. Whenever the body wakes you up. And this is every day? This is every day. Even when you're not working? Of course. <laughs> Especially when you're not working. Especially when you're not working. <laughs> um, and so you mentioned this siesta mm -hmm. is after lunch. Yeah. Let's talk about food. Mm -hmm. like how do we uh, know when is a good time to eat? If you have a nap right after lunch. Well, the Spanish culture for eating is quite different to the rest of the world. Mm. Especially the timing. Okay. It's like we have Breakfast, desayuno. Breakfast is desayuno. 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 And then we have lunch, almuerzo. Almuerzo. Around 2.30 p.m. to 3. Okay, that's Those late. Good, that's perfect time <laughs> for us. Yeah. Then we have like a little snack after siesta. Okay. Which is merienda. Merienda. Perfecto. And finally, dinner. Because of the sunset in Spain, it's really late. Mm. Like around, in summer it can be 10, 10, 15. 10, PM? PM. Wow. Yeah, it's, it's okay. a long day. So, desayuno and then? Almuerzo. Almuerzo. <laughs> Almuerzo. And I feel I can pronounce it better when I have the hand gesture. Yeah, yeah, it's important. Well. it's important. Almuerzo. Almuerzo. Siesta. Siesta. Mm. Merienda. Merienda. Y cena. Cena. Got it. And you've brought, um, you've brought some food for yeah. us today, right? Yeah. Could you tell me about it? Okay. This is jamón. 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 So jamón is the most delicious food in Spain. It's like a treat. It's not like a proper food, you know, like an a, appetizer. Yeah. A snack. It's not, yeah. It's like a, and for a lot of people who doesn't know about it, it can look quite disgusting. Hmm. They think maybe it's like raw meat. It's not. But this I knew, I grew up under, this is cured meat. It's cured, right. exactly. And it's delicious. Yeah. So jamón and just maybe you can accompany it with regaña. 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 <laughs> Again, exactly. I need the, uh, Re I need works, the hand. It yes. works with the hand. Yeah, regaña. Regaña. Almuerzo. Almuerzo. Exactly. Got so it. it's kind of like a hard bread. Mm. I would say like a, you break it and you use it like a cracker. Yeah. Kind of. This is before dinner. Ah, okay. Because of the long time between merienda. Merienda. And cena. Cena. You're saying now there's a new meal in between. There's a new. There's always a space to squeeze a new meal. That makes sense. That's a that, that little aperitivo. Mm -hmm. Aperitivo. 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 Exactly. So then you have a little bit, so you make a space. And... So given that we're only really talking about, I mean, the two most important things for us, mm. food and sleep. Exactly. There is this uh, thing about Spanish being lazy. I wonder what, no. Say with me, vago. Vago. Lazy. Lazy. It's vago. Vago. 
No somos vagos. No somos vagos. No. We are chilled. Mm. Tranquilos. 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 So, we're not lazy. We're chill. Mm. No somos vagos. No somos vagos. Somos tranquilos. Somos tranquilos. Exacto. Um, well, I thank you so much for, for, thank you. for being with us it was today. Thank you. a pleasure. Um, I think we definitely have to end this with that phrase you shared earlier. Yeah. Maybe we can do it one more time. We can do it. We can cheers to yes, that. Yes, we of course we can cheers to that. So. No somos vagos. No somos vagos. Somos tranquilos. Somos tranquilos. Cheers. Cheers. Hey everyone, no seas vago. If you liked today's conversation, please remember to like, comment, and subscribe to the Glossica YouTube channel. Dale a me gusta, suscribiros al canal de Glossica. See you next time. Hasta, Hasta luego. luego.